and they're off. Tessie's Red Sox is away sharply and gunning right for the early lead. America's Queen also comes away, and now America's Queen going to the early lead. I am luring. Comes away with a top flight and racing along third, and far back in the early going is Awesome Dream as they link up with the main track. America's Queen strikes to the lead three parts of length. Earthly is there racing as second. That's Tessie's Red Sox from between horses now being passed by Koya Kana. Up on the outside and Lemon Water attacks toward the rail. Inca Princess on the far outside. Then it's a length and a half farther back to the heavy favorite, Candy for All. Then it's four lengths farther back to Mighty Frosty down along the inner rail. Then it's a gap of five, Freight Train Lane up on the outside, followed by Time Shift at this point, 11th. Two lengths farther back to the trailer, Awesome Dream. As they swing around the far turn, America's Queen is loose on the lead by a length and a half. Eartha is set down for the drive second, but here comes the heavy favorite, Candy for All. And Camacho has her rolling up on the outside. And now she's going to the lead, way out in the center of the racetrack. That's Candy for All with the lead. America's Queen is a tiring second. With a furlong to run, Candy for All has the lead. Eartha. Battling back gamely toward the rail. Here's a late run by Koya Kana, trying to be part of the trifecta. But Candy for All, living up to the hype at four to five, much the best. Tight for second between Eartha and a fast closing Koya Kani. Perfecta, 4.31.50. The pick three, 229.70, and there will be a high five carryover. Next up, the other division of the Tampa Turf Test, Colts and Gilding's End, to be run at a mile and an eighth. 